For this demonstration, you will need a TSP 652 Bluetooth and an iPad. First thing you're going to do is a self test. You're going to hold the feed button down on the front of the printer while turning the power on. So the first thing we're going to look at is the BD name, which is Star Micronics by default. This is the name that we're going to be looking for when we go to pair the printer with our iPad in a few seconds. The next thing we're going to be looking at is the auto connection setting and later I will explain why that's important. In order to pair the printer with our iPad, we first need to hold down the pair button for five seconds or until the green light flashes once. At which point it will begin to flash consistently and you will have 60 seconds to pair the printer with your iPad. Once you've held down the pairing button on the printer, you're going to open up settings and wait for Star Micronics to appear in the list of devices. You're going to tap it once it appears. And you've now paired your printer with your iPad. The auto connect feature will allow the printer to reconnect with the last iPad it was used with in the event that the iPad leaves range, the iPad is turned off, or the printer is turned off. To enable or disable the auto connect feature, you hold down on the reset button on the back of the printer for a few seconds. The printer will then reset itself and print out a confirmation page of the new setting.